My name is Christian Clausen. I'm a technical marketing engineer for content security here at Cisco. In this video, I'm going to walk through the basic policy configuration, search and remediation capabilities of Cloud Mailbox Defense. Let's get started. After completing the initial setup wizard, the next step is to set up the automated remediation policy. The policy configuration is accomplished on a single screen, the one seen here. On the left side of the page, we have the ability to change the mode of the product, and therefore to either downgrade or upgrade the permissions granted to Cloud Mailbox Defense by your Microsoft deployment. The Message Analysis option allows you to choose what messages to scan. If you're already using Cisco Cloud Email Security as a secure email gateway solution, you may not want to scan messages which traverse your email edge because Cisco is already scanning them. You can choose incoming, outgoing, internal, or any combination of the three. Any messages which are journaled to Cloud Mailbox Defense will still show up in the search and reporting data, but they can be exempted from receiving a verdict using this option. The Attachment Analysis option allows you to choose what attachments are sent to ThreatGrid for dynamic analysis. When this option is enabled, any file whose SHA-256 fingerprint are unknown and which contain dynamic content, such as macros or embedded JavaScript, are uploaded to ThreatGrid and detonated to determine whether they are malicious. You can choose to analyze attachments which are incoming, internal, outgoing, or any combination of the three. The current remediation actions available in Cloud Mailbox Defense are move to the trash folder or move to the junk folder. You can choose which action to take on each of our three verdicts, malicious, spam, or phishing. The Automated Remediation section allows you to choose which domains in your Microsoft tenant this policy is applied to. The home page provides some statistics about the traffic mix and verdicts over the last 24 hours. It is also a jumping off point for searching across all of the messages that have been journaled to Cloud Mailbox Defense over the previous 90 days. From here you can quickly search using any of the metadata that we have indexed including sender, recipient, subject, embedded URL, or file name. Results are displayed in the search and triage dashboard. We provide a simple date picker for the search results which defaults to 24 hours. Search results are displayed with the most recent on the top and is organized into columns which includes the directionality of a message as well as basic header information. Expanding each search result provides additional headers as well as the names of any attachments or embedded URLs. Any details which overflow the record can be explored by following the More link. Results can be filtered based on the verdict in order to show only messages which Cloud Mailbox Defense has convicted as malicious, phishing, or spam. Trusted messages are those which an administrator has manually classified as clean. Selecting one or more records causes the remediation menu to appear. Whenever an action is taken on a message, a menu is presented that allows for reclassification. This is how we receive reports of false negatives and false positives. Messages can also be remediated without reclassification. The timeline option provides details about when a message was received and what actions were taken. Here you can see whether a message was moved automatically or manually. That information is also available via the shield icon, which denotes an automated remediation action. In addition to the global search, you can search only specific fields such as the sender, recipient, or subject. Using our conversation view feature, you can get an interactive graphical representation of an email thread in order to understand how a message moved through your environment. That concludes the walkthrough of our policy configuration search and remediation capabilities. Thank you for joining. I hope this has been useful.